Whew. After those three previous clips, it's time to get back to business here. Uh, UFO Leaks has an interesting uh, story. Uh, the 1971 Virginia Giant uh, occupant uh, case. Uh, strange sightings in the early summer of 1971. Fredrickson, Virginia, remain unexplained today. I'll uh, put that article uh, up in the uh, link on the uh, description. And got some interesting um, images of one of Saturn's moons where it looks like there's a lot of activity in terms of plumes. Um, what's being discharged from this moon of Saturn uh, quite interesting photograph, so you'll uh, get to take a look at that. And I also noticed I went to uh, UFO Leaks' uh, site, and they've uh, redesigned it. Um, from what I see, they have a lot less stories up. Now, the ones they have here are all in Spanish, so I don't speak Spanish, so I can't really tell you what the stories are. Um, let me take a look. What do they have on Gab? I'll go there and see. Okay. Oh, let's see, what is this all? Corey Good, Unity in the Community. Well, I'm not going to even address that at all because I don't believe in any of that 20 and back bullshit stuff. Uh, let's see. On their um, Gab page here, they've got uh, information on documentary on the Anunnaki. And uh, so that's quite uh, interesting. Uh, and been catching up on uh, Project Blue Book on the History Channel. Um, part 1 and Part B of Roswell, those were good. Uh, they had one of something about... Uh, UFO event in uh, Kentucky and the aliens coming out and in a forest and attacking a family in their cabin that was a little on the pokey side. But, uh, you know, it's it's worth observing. Uh, they had another one on Area 51, showed a interesting image of uh, the uh, rumored uh, facility that's within a the mountain. They did very well on the graphics on that. It's a good episode to uh, follow. And let's see here, where are we on the time? We will probably uh, get back with you a little bit later on some more content. I'll get these images up. And so with that, we will see you in the next clip.